Our Transtar cameras caught quite a wild scene on the freeway this morning. Police chasing a teenager who was on a four-wheeler. It started in Umble and lasted for about an hour, as we see on this map, finally ending on the East X Freeway at Hamblin. Our Sophia Beausoleil joining us live near Umble High School, where this all began. Sophia? Police say they do not know what the 15-year-old was thinking, but they say what he did was extremely dangerous and that he should have stopped when they spotted him near Umble High School. Hearing about a car chase in the Houston area is not uncommon, but seeing someone ride a four-wheeler on the freeway, well, that's a new one. Maybe he was taking a joyride today and he made a bad decision today not to stop for the police. Sergeant Jack Burt with the Humble Police Department says he's seen his share of traffic pursuits in the last 18 years, but Thursday morning was a little different. I've never seen one ever get on the freeway before. It all started near Humble High School when police say they received a call Thursday morning around 930 about a four-wheeler on the road, which is illegal. He went to pull him over to let him know to basically get off the roadway and he refused to stop. Traveling between 40 to 50 miles per hour, police say the 15-year-old evaded authorities in multiple agencies for about an hour through neighborhoods, a bayou, and then finally onto the East Tex Freeway. When he got on the freeway, we terminated our pursuit. What we did, we, we, you can see that we did stay behind the vehicle, but we did it for safety reasons. The teen exited FM 1314, surrendered, and his four-wheeler was also taken away. I recommend if you're driving a four-wheeler down the road and an officer goes to pull you over, stop and talk to the officer because most of the time they're going to tell you, get off the roadway, and that's for your safety. And police say that the teen is in their custody. It's unclear what he will be charged with. Reporting live from Humble, Sophia Beausoleil, KPRC, Channel 2 News.